The inaugural Teddy Painter Memorial All-Star Game is set to be held at the University of Pikeville Gymnasium Saturday, May 11th. The tournament will feature 15th region players from schools throughout the district with the girls game beginning at 6 p.m. and the boys game to follow. So we are hosting the Mountaintop Sports Teddy Painter All-Star Memorial Scrimmage on Saturday, May 11th at the Old U Pike Gym. It's just the University of Pikeville Gym, but many people now call it the Old U Pike Gym. It's going to start at 6 p.m. with the girls game and then the boys game will follow. We have so much local talent from across the 15th region. All the schools have been invited to at least send one player. So all these schools are kind of coming together as one to honor our beloved sports director, Teddy Painter. Do you worry about having enough money to last throughout retirement? Give Reed Potter at Raymond James a call. Reed has 26 years experience helping folks enjoy their best life in their retirement years. All donations from the game will go directly to Teddy's family to aid in medical bills and funeral costs. We are hosting the Teddy Painter Memorial All-Star Scrimmage, not only because Teddy was, had such an impact on our community and on our local athletes, but this is also to help raise money for his family, for medical bills, funeral expenses, and their time of need. But this is something we wanna to continue to do in the years to come. My goal for it is to eventually do a Teddy Painter Scholarship. Before his death, Teddy had announced plans to retire in May with the All-Star Game originally planned to be his send-off after 50 years of work in sports journalism. When Teddy got very sick on us, I decided we need to do something for Teddy. And he was planning on retiring in May for those who may have missed that. And we wanted to kind of give him a, a last celebration. And Teddy knew that we were gonna do this game. Um, he was actually planning on coming to the game and he was so excited when I was telling him like all the kids that were wanting to be involved in it, all the coaches, all the officials. He honestly, he cried <laughs> when I told him. And I wish that he would have been able to be at this event, but I couldn't let it go to the side. I wanted to make sure that we still did this to honor Teddy and that we always honor Teddy Painter with this because like I said, he was so excited. He was excited to come and get to see some of those kids he's covered for so many years, play possibly one last time and just be around the sports world and the people that he loved so much. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.